boiling bass strings. Some people say it works, some people say it doesn't work. But what I'm here to find out is if it works, if it doesn't work. In fact, you yourself can be the judge of it. I'm going to give you a before sample and an after sample of boiling the strings, and you tell me if it works. So, obviously, the first thing you're going to want to do is take off your bass strings. Then, once you've done that, pop on the kettle. This will make your time a lot less. Now with your strings off your bass, this is a brilliant time to give your whole bass a nice clean. So wipe down the fretboard, wipe down the body, just make it look really nice. Once the kettle's boiled, pour it into the pan. Once the water's in the pan, you can switch the hob on and wait for it to start bubbling. When you can see that the water's bubbling, then you want to put your strings in. Now make sure you coil them up really nicely so this doesn't happen, what happened to me. Otherwise you're going to have to get your tongs and shove them into the water because you didn't coil them up nicely. Then if your water doesn't fill over all of the strings you might want to just top it up a bit like I did. Now what you're going to want to do is just leave the strings in there boiling at a high heat for around 5 to 15 minutes. I left mine in for 10 minutes and that seemed to work fine for me. And like I said earlier, whilst you're doing this, give your bass a clean. Now already by looking in the pan, we can see that around the pan and in the water it looks more dirty than it started. That means that this boiling is in fact working. So, once you're satisfied with how long you've left your bass strings in the boiling water, lay down a few paper towels, get your tongs out, take the strings out of the pot and just lay them there to dry. Looking into the pan afterwards, you can see all the dirt that came off of our bass strings. The time has now come to restring your bass with your freshly boiled strings. Okay, so the strings are back on the bass guitar now and whilst tuning that, I could already tell there is a difference there. That sounds much brighter already, so that being said, let's get straight into the sound test. What do you guys think? Did boiling the strings make the tone any better? I think it did. But yeah, let me know in the comments or in the card up there. I'll put a little poll so you can tell me what you think. So, that wraps up this video. I hope it's been informative for you. Whether you go on to boil your strings or just buy new strings. But if you're in a really tight situation, you've got a gig next week, you can't afford any strings right now, pop them in the pot. Boil them. Because... In my situation, it appeared to work, but you can be a judge of that by the sound test. So, hope you've enjoyed. Make sure to click like if you like the video. Subscribe if you want to see more. Leave a comment, tell me how you think. See you in the next one.